Hello viewers, hope you're doing well. Today in this video, I'm going to create JWT configuration and the JWT utils file. In the JWT configuration file, we will generate a secret random key that we'll use to generate the JWT token of the user. So in the JWT utils file, we will create a generate token function where we will create the JWT token of the user with the expiration. So let's get started. In the SRC package, I'm going to create here the new folder that is a utils. In the utils package, I'm going to create here the new file that is a JWT utils.js. So let me open here the terminal and here I'm going to write the command to install the crypto. Let's hit enter. And you can see here crypto installed successfully. Let me open here the package.json and you can see here the version of the crypto that is a 1.0.1. .1. So let me close the terminal. And here in the configuration package, I'm going to create here the new class that is a JWT config.js. So first of all, I'm going to import here the crypto. After importing the crypto, I'm going to write the functionality to generate the random secret key. I'm going to initialize here the variable that is a const secret key. And here we need to call crypto dot random bytes. And here in the argument, I'm going to add here the random key length that is a 32. And we need to change into the string. So after that, I'm going to export this. So let me add here module dot exports. And we need to export the secret key. Okay, well, let me close this. Let's go to JWT utils. In this file, I'm going to create here the function that is a generate token. The generate token will receive the user object. So let me open here the terminal and I'm going to install the JSON web token. So the command is npm install JSON web token. Let's hit enter. And you can see JSON web token installed successfully. Let me open here the package.json and you can see here the version of the JWT that is a 9.0.2. So, first of all, I'm going to import here the JSON web token. After that, I'm going to import here the secret key that I have created in the JWT config.js in the configuration package. In the require, we need to add the path. After importing the JWT and the secret key, I'm going to create here the function that is a generate token. In the argument, it will receive a user object. After the function, I'm going to export this. So let me add here module.exports. And we need to export this function that is a generate token. Okay, so inside the generate token function, I'm going to create here the object that is a payload. So first we have ID, we will get ID from user dot underscore ID. Second, we have email, we will get email from user dot email. Third, we have a role and we will get role from user dot role. Okay, after that, I'm going to return here JWT dot sign. So first we need to pass here the payload and second, we need to pass here the secret key. And after that, we need to add here the expiration of the token. So let me add here expire in that is a 60 minutes. Okay that's all for now from my side in the next video we will create the login service and the login controller i hope you like this video if you have any confusion you can do comment and also subscribe to my channel for more videos and hit the bell icon thanks for watching take care bye